Hi everybody, welcome back. Are you ready friends? It is time for Mini Madness round two. So if you're unfamiliar with my Mini Madness, I will leave my uh, playlist down below of my Mini Madness from last year that I did in collaboration. This year I'm on my own doing that. But basically what this is, is it's kind of a panning project where you pick 10 mini items and then you roll out and then roll in new ones. So as you use a product up, you roll that out and pull a new one in. And at the end of the year, we see how much we got used up. Last year's Mini Madness, 30 freaking items. Are you kidding me? So proud of myself. So this year we're starting off with a new crop of minis um, and I try to put in a pretty good variety of the samples I have or maybe just things I really want to get used and that's really kind of the thing for this mini mask. If you're getting any kinds of subscription services like Ipsy or Birchbox or Sephora Play like I do or BoxyCharm or any of those, a lot of times you get all these little tiny products. If you're like me, they just sit in a big old basket over there and you'll eventually get to it. This is a great way to get in there, dive in, get these products out, give them a try, see what you think about them. Either love them or, you know, pitch them and have a little bit of fun while you're doing it. Without much further ado, let's get in and see what we're diving into to begin with. So I decided to put some hair product in here first. We're starting off with the Briogeo. This is the Blossom and Bloom Ginseng and Biotin Volumizing Spray. Cora Organics. This is Noni Glow Facial Oil. So it's winter time. I figured that's a really good time to try a face oil. So we're starting off here with this and this does, it's a pretty small amount, but you know, face oil, I don't use very much. So see how long that hangs around. From First Aid Beauty, we have the Coconut Micellar Makeup Melter. So I'll be really excited to give this a try. From Makeup Forever, we have an Artist Rouge Cream Lipstick. This one is in the shade C211, 7211. You know, they always use numbers. It's that color. It's kind of a My Lips But Better shade. So we will see how this goes. From Dr. Brandt, we have a Pore Refiner Primer because just can't not say no to a primer. Kind of a gimme. But you know, you gotta psych yourself up yeah, a little bit. This is from Living Proof. This is the uh, No Frizz Nourishing Oil. Kind of a larger one in here, but it is a clay mask, so I'll probably have to use a little bit more is kind of what my thinking was. From Origins, this is the Original Skin Retexturizing Mask, and this is with Rose Clay. One of my favorites, I know this is only gonna be around three months. This will be leaving us uh, May, March 30th, and it is the It Cosmetics Superhero Mascara. This is like my favorite mascara ever. I love, love this stuff. And I thought, why not a repeat item? But a tiny repeat item. It is the Clinique Pep Start Eye Cream. And rounding out our list. And you know, Belief played me last year with that Aqua Eye Balm. So now we're going to try the Belief, the True Cream Moisturizing Balm and see if it lives up to that eye balm. And so that's it. That is our intro to our mini madness round two. Got our 10 little products here. Wish me luck. I get some good use out of them. Hopefully I will. Some of them I know I'm definitely going to. So those are kind of gimmies, but you kind of have to give yourself a gimme, you know, gotta boost up your confidence a little bit sometime. <laughs> Once again, I of course want to thank you as always for spending a little bit of your time with me today. I truly, truly do appreciate it. Thumbs up if you like these little mini panning projects because I do. Again, if you want to check out the previous ones that I did before, I will link that playlist for you down below. And as always, before you leave, make sure that you are subscribed to my channel. You definitely don't want to miss out on any videos that I have coming up. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.